Harrison. Hi. Good morning, everyone. Good afternoon, no? Almost. I have to say good afternoon. Yes, right, good right. afternoon. And uh, we've got a very special episode today. Mm-hmm. Harrison, what are we making today? Today, actually, I'm going to make my one of the, my signature dishes. Spicy tuna bonbon. Right. Yes. One of my favorite things to eat. Mm-hmm. It's actually for VIPs in the restaurant whenever they came in to eat. Today is very, very special guest. Even I was uh, in Japan, even I watch him, watch TV show. And recently I do also the, in the YouTube too. You know who is it? Mr. Chef uh, Martin. T- Chef Yan, you know what? I admire you. You are truly the master of sushi. I remember when I visit Florida, I will never miss the restaurant and taste your sushi. And your knife skill amazes me. So I'm going to share with you how a typical Chinese chef using another Chinese chef knife. So you're doing something very special. Yes. Actually, the great thing about Japanese food is you use the freshest yes. and the best quality ingredients. Yes. And then it's also very healthy. You use very little oil, not as much salt. And so I would love to see what you're doing with this wonderful sushi with this yellow fin tuna. This is sushi great. Yes, sashimi great. Show us how to do it because everybody would love to see this, particularly you love sushi. This is a spicy sushi. You're gonna love it. I know I will love it. You see how the skill, look at the skill, the nice skill of a master. First, you gotta have a sharp knife, right, chef? Yes. A sharp knife is actually a safe knife. You don't want to yes. use a dull knife. Yes, if you use a uh, sh- knife is not sharp, more dangerous. Yeah, yeah, that's true. A sharp knife is a safe knife. Yes. Basically, you chop, you cut it up into dice, dice, dice pieces. Cut. Yeah. Small dice cut. Yeah. Oh, chef, while you are doing this, I'm going to show you something, okay? Yes. You are from the east. I'm yes. from the west. So it's east meets west. Yes. So, in California, in the summer, a lot of fruits. So I'm going to do a chicken salad with California summer fruit. I have chicken, chicken breast, sh- shredded cucumber, purple cabbage, head lettuce, and carrot, and red bell pepper. And then also a lot of summer fruit. We have California cantaloupe, honeydew, and pineapple, and blueberry, and watermelon. They're all from nice. California. So we know that in Florida, the most famous mm. is the lychee. So I'm going to surprise you. We're going to oh, use wow. the Florida, Florida lychee, lychee to do an appetizer to surprise you. In the meantime, go ahead and do it. And yes. I'm going to cut up these. I'll seesaw this. Okay. And then I will cut this up and then butterfly this like you. Okay. Look at that. We'll butterfly. We'll butterfly because I'm going to julienne this okay and then we put it all together and then we'll cut it up and then all of these are all cut up like this okay and then this one I will put it over here and then I also cut up a tiny bit of lettuce okay because I press this a little bit and I go Shredded lettuce. Okay. Shredded lettuce. And this way, also, we have some fruit. We have some camp cantaloupe. We have some watermelon and pineapple. I use the same technique as you do. Parallel cut. Look at that. One. And then two. And then three. And then when this is done, I stack them all up and put it back here and I line them all up like this and then I go just like what you're doing shred it and then this is pineapple and then for cant for cantaloupe and watermelon we'll do the same thing parallel cut parallel cut and then I'll line them all up like this once again see Julian this is all ready. I have all the ingredients already cut up. We'll see what else you're doing. So first I'm gonna put the sriracha sauce oh, sriracha, here. that means it's chili, chili yes, sauce. Chili sauce. Sriracha is a chili sauce, very popular 
and Japan, Japanese, Korean, Korea. and uh, Vietnamese, Thai, mm. and Chinese restaurant. And next one is a kimchi sauce. Oh, what, what kind of sauce is kimuchi, it? Kimchi. 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 Oh, what, what's the flavor of this? This is also um, from the chili paste. Oh, I chili mean, chili paste. paste. And then garlic and vinaigrette all mixed it together. Oh, so garlic, so it's more than it's chili paste, garlic, and vinegar all together. All so together. it's a little bit different than the regular chili sauce. The next one mayonnaise. is I'm going to add a little bit of mayonnaise. Yeah, yeah, this is homemade mayonnaise. Yes. Yeah. And sesame oil. Oh, sesame oil. Just a little Perfect. bit. Perfect. Yes. These are marinated, these are not cooking sesame oil. This is very rich. And then you use it for flavoring yes. and for marinade. Never, never use for cooking because it's extracted from roasted sesame seed. Look yeah. at that. Yeah, I can smell it already. Mm, amazing. The sesame is really just the right yes. amount. And the mayonnaise and the chili, it's going to be absolutely delicious. Like While you're stirring frying this, I'm going to put the whole dish together, sure. okay? Here, I have uh, some a tomato. I'm going to slice the tomato. One, two. Cut, 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 cut. That's why it's so important to have a sharp knife. When this is done, look at that. Okay? And then I will garnish this. Now this is it. I want to show everybody how easy it is. Both of our dishes are actually easy to do. As I said, Yan can, so can you. Yan can, Chef Hero can, uh, and you can. Me oh, too, okay. Yeah. I'm ready. Now, look at this. <laughs> This is the slice of tomato. I put this let pet lettuce right in the middle. Okay, look at that. This is assembled. And this is purple lettuce. Okay. Okay. And this is carrot. This is ah purple lettuce and cucumber. This is very healthy. The more vegetable the more combination vegetables you eat, the better. Look at that. And then you put the chicken right over here. And this is chicken breast. And you can uh, use ch chicken thigh to do other dishes because I bone my own chicken, okay? And then when this is all nice and done, I will cut up some green onion. This is how we save time. We'll do it all together. Go. Oh, perfect. And then you sprinkle this right on top. Right on top. And then the summer fruit. Oh, this is it. The summer fruit, we'll put it on the side. Okay? The summer fruit, you put on the side. Summer fruit, we'll put on the side. So this is very, very California because this is so healthy and it's so nice. It looks great. And then blueberry here and there. And this is such a healthy salad, summer healthy salad. And then I have, I have to borrow a tiny bit of your mayonnaise. Yes. Yeah, put a tiny bit of your mayonnaise. Okay, put a tiny bit of mayonnaise. I have wasabi here and a tiny bit of sriracha. I put it right over here. And then sesame seed oil. Yes, look at that. I use the same. I'm so glad you bring all the seasoning. I mix them all up, but this is easy. But the easiest way to do is you put this in a container. You shake them, emulsify. This way, the dressing is well mixed. Look at that, that's the way to do it. But if I want to make it more interesting, which is in China and Japan, in Chinese cuisine, Jap Japanese, they use, use, use a lot of uh, ginger, right? Yes. Use a lot of ginger. So I use this wonderful grater. You, you go to ginger, look at that. This is my plane. Look at that, all the gingers here. So all I have to do is put a tiny bit of this ginger grate, I put it right here. Mm. So this way is wasabi, ginger, mayonnaise, sesame seed oil. Shake, shake, shake. <laughs> okay, so you know, you gotta have fun, okay? So look at that. When this is done, you all you have to do is Oh, oh, this is a salad dressing. Look at that. Nice. Summer salad. So beautiful. Ah, oh, look at that. Beautiful. In the meantime, everybody know that in Japanese and Chinese cooking, they use sesame seed, toasted sesame seed. And also, 
green onion on top, candy ginger, and then sesame seed, and this. Look at that. Look at this. This is a summer salad that I have created for you. This is specially prepared for you. Thank you very the much. California summer salad. That looks so delicious. Okay, oh so unique. So let's yes. see what you're going to do and put it all together. Yes. Very thin slices. Look at that. Look at the skill. Look at master at work. Not only is thin, it's very uniform. Every single slice, same thing. That's because you see how Chef Hero's fingers moving very, very rich, slowly and precisely. So that's the reason why every single cut would be very, very thin. Yeah, you see, like, like a little meat, uh, like sushi a, bowl, like a sushi a bowl, spicy or a sushi onigiri, bowl. Onigiri bowl. Nice and firm, beautiful. Like this? Yeah, look at that. Like, like a meat ball, like a sushi Yes, like bowl. a meat ball, yes. <laughs> Next one, I want to yeah. add this one to the top first. Wow, look at that. Then I'm going to use Avocado. a plastic. Yeah, yeah. yeah. You shake them in a two rice not round ball. This is... I've never seen this in a, in a, some of the sushi bar in, a, in California. Usually I do make with um, sushi rice and oh. then the fish on the top. Oh. That's what we call it, temari sushi. Oh, yes, yes. So, so in a true sense, you know, being a chef, you can be very creative. You can do whatever you want. Just be creative and create yes. your own. Now you have the... Taking off the film. Beautiful. Then looks make like a, little a golf bit of ball, shape. the golf ball size. Yes. yes. Beautiful. The salmon roll, salmon roll to give color contrast and also flavor contrast. Color, flavor, contrast, texture contrast. Yeah, look at it. Look at the master work. And then the slanted angle. And then you put it right on. So this is a little touch. So look at that. Yes. This is actually a final product in a sense, right? Yes. This is a final product. Look at this. This is not only using the freshest ingredient, but skill, skill. But of course, when you do it at home, you don't have to do it so precise. The great thing about this is it's tasty. I can tell without <laughs> tasting it. I can smell it already. It's got to be the mm. best sushi, unique sushi. This is the gold ball size, just the right size. Beautiful. I'm gonna. I'm dying to try it. Sure. Okay. I'm gonna make another formal dishes. Yeah, you're gonna do and put it together. And yeah, we'll do it together. In the meantime, I know that you love tuna. Yes. I have done something. We are standing in front of this pagoda. Look at that. Yeah. So I'm gonna make sushi pagoda. Sushi it's pagoda. an appetizer. Look at that. This is shrimp, Brussels sprout, pan fried scallop, tuna, tuna. and Lychee Lychee from, from Florida. Florida and then I have a special sauce here and this is sriracha and Thai sweet sauce look at that I put it right here I put it right here and I put it right here look at that and then this is to honor your principal actor your wonderful Tuna, and that's why we have tuna wow. here. And then we have your Florida, your home state, Florida lychee, scallop, and shrimp. Sure. And then when this is done, I use one of these. I have, this is from my home garden. This is a lemon balm yeah. mint. And then this is also edible flower from my home garden. Look at that. This is fish. This is my one of my signature of spicy tuna bonbon. And this is and my tuna seafood trail pagoda. pagoda. And then for you to welcome you to California, I have this wonderful summer, summer. chicken salad Cheese. with California fruits. And this is uh, for chef. 
Oh, you're doing Yaki, chicken yakitori? too? Yes. Oh, you know, this is one of my favorite. Yes. Chicken yakitori. yakitori. What kind of seasoning sauce that you use here? This is so beautiful. You know? Yes. First, I'm going to put the salt and pepper. Yeah. Then after, I'm going to put my uh, homemade uh, teriyaki sauce on it. Homemade teriyaki sauce. Yes. Share the secret of your homemade teriyaki sauce later on. Let yes. me see Since we have all of these, actually, we can enjoy our creations yes. inside this pagoda. pagoda. Our guest today, Master Chef Martin Yen. Today, I'm the apprentice. I'm the sous chef of Master Chef hero. I'm so um, <laughs> honored to be here with you and it's so educational not just only for your fan but also for me. I have not seen this in California uh, sushi bar so thank you so much yeah, for sharing this with cool. us and since we are having tasting menu tasting in this beautiful pagoda so I present it with you and your fans the sushi tuna pagoda. And of course, uh, I'm so glad that you show me this yakitori because this is wonderful. I love it. You can use yeah. beef, you can use pork, you can use chicken and all kind of stuff. Yes. And even inert. Yeah. So now, welcome you to California with this wonderful California fruit flavor chicken salad. Okay. What we'd like to do is I want to taste your sushi first. Yes. Okay. Please. So. This is for you, and this is all of these four for me. Oh, right. Yes. <laughs> okay. Let's taste. Okay. This is so beautiful. You don't need to serve with any other uh, 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 soy sauce or anything. If you like, uh, oh. you can add that. Oh, you can add a tiny bit of soy sauce. sauce. So yes. I have the tiny bit of soy sauce here. Just give you a few drop. Oh. These are the best quality soy sauce. Double fermented. Oh, just nice. enough. You don't want to overkill the flavoring, right? Cheers. Cheers. Mmm. Mm. Oh. You are hungry? Very hungry today. <laughs> <laughs> you supposed to eat the whole thing? No shot. Mm. How's it taste, chef? It's so good that I'm speechless. The creaminess of the avocado melt into the spicy tuna. Soft, moist, and delicious. So this three is mine, yes. reserved for yes, me. Please. Okay, so don't touch it. Now, here, in your honor, I have created this wonderful pagoda for you. Look at that. Oh. oh. Okay. And then this pagoda is so perfect because we're eating this in, s in this pagoda, mm. beautiful pagoda. This is actually, I was in a, in a, a wonderful restaurant in uh, Hong Kong. And then in China, in Guangzhou, China, where I was born, they actually, that gentleman designed that wonderful big pagoda in that hotel actually designed this pagoda. So we are sitting with history. This is historical. This pagoda actually moved from Guangzhou, China, my hometown, to here. to here. So let's try this one at a time. Because with the wonderful sauce already, this is appetizer. For the lychee. Mmm. Tuna. Tuna. Yellow fin. Mm. Sushi grey tuna. Amazing. Grill mm. Brussels sprout. Brussels sprout. Mm. Properly cooked. Scallop. Mm. Shrimp. Coral shrimp. Mm. 
Yep. Cheers. Japanese green tea. Now, mm. I want you to try this. I turn this chopsticks upside down. So, this is the salad. Thank you, chef. Okay. Fruit salad with California fruit with chicken. And then I will have that for myself too. Hold on to this yes. for me, please. This is beautiful. Okay, let us taste the fruit salad. The dressing I have is actually the same. Sriracha, wasabi, a tiny bit of wasabi, but very little sriracha. I want the, the, the wasabi flavor mm. infused. A tiny bit of wild honey, and I borrow a tiny bit of your mayonnaise, mayonnaise. and oh. sesame seed oil. Mm. Texture contrast. We mm. have sesame seed, we have candy ginger. Mm. What do you think? Now this fruit combination is so fresh. Mm. Bring it. And Very then, refreshing. Uh, carrots and cucumber. About texture. Add it. The chicken is a uh, chef. Uh, this is a grilled chicken or? The grilled chicken. Grilled chicken. I just grilled it. I bone a chicken. I, s I use the. Um, I save you the, um, the, ch the chicken thigh and I use the chicken breast. Mm. So I use the chicken wing to do appetite. So I normally like a uh, chef in, J in Japan and China. We bone our own chicken. Mm. Now we taste yours. This one, I'm going to put the salt and pepper first. Yeah. And then grill it and then add, add the teriyaki sauce. Oh, this is your, your teriyaki, teriyaki sauce. sauce. Original one. Yes. You have um, chicken and it's green onion in between onion. to give the flavor yes. as well as give color contrast. Let me taste this. Mmm. Moist, not overcooked. And I like the flavor of the sauces. A little bit teriyaki, but it's not too sweet. It gets a little sauce and also a tiny bit of vinegar. Absolutely perfect combination. Mmm. Okay. You know what? I'm so honored to be your guest today. You are the principal actor. I'm the supporting <laughs> cast. And I hope this is the beginning of a wonderful friendship. And hopefully we'll travel around the world to promote Asian cuisine, mm -hmm. Asian culture, Asian heritage to the rest of the world. And cheers. Cheers. Come back. I told you, this is mine too. Yes. So I'm going to try another one, and this one, I'm going to eat it like you. <laughs> it is very good. It's so good. I am speechless. Thank you again. Thank you very much, Jeff. And hopefully, We'll work together again. Yes. And this is the beginning of our wonderful friendship. Thank you. Thank you very much. Can we order pizza I got so, now? Behind so the scenes, actually, thank no, you all the <laughs> supporting <laughs> actors, oh, actresses, oh support team. Yeah. Just very good. We're going to warm this up. Thank and you to uh, and uh, Al and enjoy. Jeannie for the beautiful home. Chef Marnian. Prepping. Prepping. Look at Prepping all this. For this. This is the lychee, fresh lychee. Yes. From Florida. Oh, from Florida. Look from at Florida. That. Nice, nice. See that? Beautiful. Yeah. Lychee from Florida. And what's Hero doing? Let's look. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Relaxing. Pick it up. Oh, I see. Okay. Uh, teaspoon. Teaspoon. 
yeah, Ziploc bags are right here. Wait, 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 wait for me. Wait for me. This is how far, this is how fast this is. This is our garnish. So you can buy in the market, uh, all Asian market and um, supermarket, most sometimes have that. This, or sell the thing you Sell the thing from uh, mung bean flour. Okay, exactly. Okay. Chinese cooking. 